here today to talk about the proper way to clean and inspect Klein wire pulling grips. First, I'll check the alignment of the grips of the jaw. So the jaw, this one looks good that direction, and also inspect the jaw opening. So this one looks good. Next, I'll actuate the grip several times for our smooth operation. Next, I'll lock the grip open and look inside the jaw to make sure that there is no debris, damage, or other buildup. I'll also look at each rivet to make sure I do not see any bent rivets. Some grips have hot latches, like this one. I will cycle the hot latch a few times to make sure it functions smoothly. An example of a bent rivet is this one. You can see the lever is pushed out to the side. Cleaning should be done before each use. Proper eyewear and gloves should be worn. A general spray cleaner degreaser can be used. First, I will spray between each rivet. And cycle the grip a few times so that the degreaser can penetrate. Next, I will lock the jaw open again and spray the cleaner inside the jaw opening on the top and the bottom. Since this is a round jaw grip, I will use the round brush. Scrub, scrub this until I do not find any more debris. And then I will grab a dry, clean cloth to wipe out all of the degreaser. We can recheck the jaw opening to look for more buildup. If there is more buildup, I can repeat the steps spray the cleaner inside the jaw area, and again, use my round brush to clean inside the jaw. There's no more debris in this one, so my brushing is done. I will again take my clean dry cloth and complete the cleaning. It is important to never leave the cleaner or degreaser inside the jaw area. Grips come with maintenance cards. These maintenance cards should be retained for future reference. Never repair any grip. Grips that are misaligned, bent, or otherwise distorted should be taken out of service. If there are any questions, contact Klein Customer Service.